All right, what's up everyone? It's me Barky and I'm here with another mod showcase for Rimworld 1.0 and this is the vanilla fishing expanded made by the same people who generally make the vanilla expanded series of mods. And so it's Oscar Patoki and then usually with a few other mates here and there. So this one in particular is Sarge Bjornsson. I think that's how you say his name. This is vanilla fishing expanded. It adds in fishing to the game. As you can see, I've done some nice pixel art. I'm very good at Minecraft, so I've done some pixel art on the beaches over here just to sort of mark out where the different zones are. But the gist of the mod is that it adds in the ability to fish and it starts off with a new zone that you get from going into the zone tab over here and adding it in. So if you go ahead and add fish, it does have a minimum size requirement. So it says this zone is too small, fishing zones need to be at least 25 it's because it hasn't checked yet. So if you let it update, there we go, you'll see fishing zone number four. This zone is set to catch fish of size medium, fish in the zone, bay, bass, I think that's how you say it, bass, eel, trout, anglerfish, haddock, mackerel, and puffer fish. And then oceanic fishing zones. So you get two different types of fishing zones. So it's oceanic and river. And that just decides which fish are in it. But it has a whole lot of different fish varieties. So it adds in a new tab over here called fish as a work. So I'll go ahead and set fish to one. Go ahead and do that and allow them to fish. So I've got some god tier colonists here. Let's go ratter. The uh, skills are based on your animal skills. So I went ahead and set the loan speed at, you know, whatever it was, 10,000. I actually think it's 65,000 just to give them a bit of a boost. While they're busy doing that, I just want to give a shout out to Dave Holloman. I think that's how you say his name. Our latest Patreon. If you want your own custom colonist in my game, so for example, if you want to see them in any custom mod showcases, etc., you can go ahead and find my Patreon link in the description below. Thanks again, Dave. This is a placeholder colonist because he hasn't sent me the exact details, but yeah. So we're going to go ahead and fish. So this is the fishing tab over here and allows you to designate the size of the fishing zone or the fish you want to catch in them. So you get small, medium, and large. Go all the way here to the large. The size of the zone has nothing to do with what sort of fish you get in it, which is fine. I guess they all need to be at least 25. So we're gonna let them fish, bring up some fish. There's a chance to fail, so don't be surprised if they do. There we go. Tuna. Got some tuna out of it. And then if we go over here to the medium size, getting some decent fish. And then the small size, we're getting a ton of fish. The different sizes. The main difference is that they provide different amounts of nutrition. So with the minimum being anchovies, which are these ones over here, anglerfish give a decent amount and it can go all the way up to some bigger large fish. So for example, the swordfish, I don't know if we have any yet. The swordfish gives 0.1 nutrition, which is a decent amount. It's quite nice, although it says 0.25 over here. Uh, the mod showcase menu might be incorrect. The mod act the mod page, excuse me. But yeah, that is the gist of the mod. I will get a lot of questions asking about if I prefer this one to Rainbow Flambe's mod. I am a bit on the fence about it. I think this one is a lot simpler and nicer in a lot of ways. Um, I think that's the beauty of most of these vanilla expanded mods. This feels like vanilla. It feels like Tiny himself could have added this in. Which is what I really enjoy about most of Oscar's mods. I think he makes fantastic stuff. I think he's one of the best modders that you can get at the moment. And this just adds to it. Anyways, you can use these fish in meals. So you go ahead and take whichever fish you're busy taking. And go and put them into meals. And you can eat them just like that. Which is pretty nice. Now the mod itself has come with several compatibilities built into it. The biggest one being alpha animals and alpha biomes. So if you do... One of these fishing zones in one of the biomes you can get some specific type of fish separate to the actual mod in those biomes but the biggest thing is that the modding of the fish has been made to be as easy as possible so if you want to add in your own fish you're welcome to it's been made as simple as it can be you just need to draw the fish and then copy some of the ymol which is the actual part of the fish in the code copy that across and you're done which is nice i might put out a video showing how to do that so people can sort of get into it leave a comment if you'd like to see something like that i think it would be relatively simple i don't know just depends on what sort of fish you want to add in, i suppose as for balance i'm a bit on the fence i kind of like it though it takes a while to fish regardless of your work speed so it still takes people quite a while to do it which is something i really really enjoy about the mod as you can see it takes quite a while i mean for what we're seeing here the fish are decomposing incredibly quickly so we're losing them 
And as you pull out more, it gets added to the stack. The one thing though I'd like to see is that the fish get pulled to you wherever you're standing. Um, so if you're fishing in the zone, they should be standing by your feet, not wherever you found them in the water. But I've seen that minimally. It actually looks like it's being changed quite a bit, but stuff like this shouldn't happen most of the time in my opinion. They should all be centered around the column, similar to this. But yeah. And again, for balance, it is a fishing mod, so you're getting food out of nowhere, but it's no different to hunting. I do think for mods like Combat Extended, for example, this will make a big difference because you don't want to waste bullets in the beginning. Now you don't have to, so if you don't want to waste bullets hunting, which is something I generally don't enjoy doing, you can do that. It's a good alternative to making a farm, waiting out, or going to go get your own animals. It is based on the animal skill, so you want to get your animal skill as high as you can. And this actually trains the skill. So it helps in both ways. If you have a lot of animals in your colony, it'll benefit from this. Anyways, that's it for Vanilla Fish and Expanded. I tried to make this video short and sweet. It is an awesome mod. Please go show Oscar some love. If you'd like to see the video of me making a custom fish, just for example, maybe we can make a bark fish or something stupid like that. Uh, just let me know and I'll record a video about it. Anyways, have a fantastic day. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you all so much. Have an awesome day. I'll hey, see you thank you very much for making it to the end of the video. It's really, really awesome of you. I've got a Discord server that's free for all to join if you'd like to come and have a chat with me or anyone else. And I've also opened up a Patreon page to help fund my videos. So if any of those interest you, please go ahead and take a look at the description. Have a great day and thank you very much for watching.